So let's say we're eating an apple or we're eating a pear or we're eating a banana, something everybody can relate to. And we eat that food and it's glucose. Well, in order for glucose to be converted into energy in the cell, it has to go through steps to transfer electrons to convert to energy. And in order to do that, we need reducing and oxidizing agents in a cell to manipulate those electrons to eventually energy. Because our whole purpose is for a cell to basically live in a good state, you know, control the redox, meaning balance out oxidizing agents and reducing agents, but to eventually create a state of energy to perform its job that its genetics have predisposed it to do in life, right? To make proteins, to make whatever that cell's function is. So let's say we eat that pear or we eat that banana or apple, and that glucose is eventually comes into what we call glycolysis or a pathway of energy to make energy.